Hello everyone and welcome back to the Bind of Isaac Repentance. Today we're actually going to play as Isaac because I've only not long realised I haven't done the lamb fight. So the lamb photo isn't there and I didn't even know that I didn't do that. So that's what we're going to do today. Hopefully. We'll see if we can get that far. So hot. Okay. Uh, we're going to change that. Little brim. I like little brim. That's good, buddy. So I've got to remember when I go for the after the mom fight. I've got to remember that it's the negative I've got to pick up. And I don't know how I didn't know that I haven't done this before. Uh, could that be the secret room? No, it can't be. This can't have a secret room next to it, so it's not there. If you leave a room after the explosion on that, it stops the coins from moving. So instead of them bouncing back into the spoke traps. Almost enough to go to the shop as well. I might still check it even if I don't get any more. Yeah, we'll do the boss first. Why did you have to keep moving? I didn't actually know that um, this monstro would hurt those guys, but it looked like it did. So that's good to know. I have to remember that for in the future. Uh, we're just going to take the Jesus Juice, damage and range up. Check the shop, see if there's anything we want in there or anything to re roll. Secret room could be up here. Okay, we've got enough money anyway. And we'll bomb into here as well. This. Okay. I like pickups. Stars, that'll be good for the next floor. So we're not wasting re rolls. Nothing I want in here. We'll just take a soul heart and go. Alright, that was a good first floor. Very happy with how that went. And we are done. Yes, we are done. Use the star card right away. Do I want that? I can reroll for better. Maybe. I'll let Little Brim deal with this. I don't think I won't. Good job, mate. Yeah. I don't know if they've nerfed Little Brim a little bit, made the damage a little bit less, but I know I was just a bit careless on that in that room. Sure. That wasn't worth it. 
just use that now because I don't really care. Oh, okay. Well, this isn't bad. Do I want anything in here? Not really. Why did I come in here? This is wasting a reroll. I guess I'll fight the boss first, see if I want what's in the boss room. And a cookbook. Pick it up at least. So that's one part of the bookworm transformation. So we've got a couple of things to work with with rerolls. step back into that. We're going to skip the devil room. So that, we don't have to worry about rerolls in there. We aren't going to reroll white coat hanger because that's tears up. Is there a battery in here? There is. Okay. I guess we're going to concentrate on rerolling in here. Bonk. Nah, no. We can do one more. And we'll just take the extra health up from the item room. That's key. Opens up. Oh, why would I do that? I think that might have opened up the boss challenge room does it I don't know it probably should have saved it for that oh well then we'll pick up the heart which is a health up would be a full health as well I think but didn't need that uh, got nothing else to do do we know where the secret room could be One of two places. Here could be one. Okay. Yeah, sure. We got one more bomb. Might as well use it. Wasn't worth it. But at least we know now. And yeah, move on. Because I lost, so I need to remember which way I'm moving. Just going all the way to the left at first. I feel like I'm going to end up finding something this way, but it's also going to really confuse me because I'm backtracking. Or is this going to take me back to the first floor, first room? I feel like this is the first room again. Um, do we do everything this way? I need to check. Did, so that was there. Okay, we're kind of going a bit rogue on what on what we were planning. That's fine. Oh, okay. We can do better. We'll just take that, ghost baby. 
familiar that shoots spectral tears, so that will shoot over gaps or rocks and things. It's kind of just like building up my whoops, my uh, familiars so I can hide and use them to do the damage for me. I want to do a couple more rooms just to get a... I would like that as well. Okay. We're going to use a bomb for this because we can get two bombs out of it. And a key. And some extra money. Burning in the fire. I could do the boss now because I don't want to wander off too much because I'm not good with remembering the layout. Gonna take safety pin for the evil up, range up, and shot speed up. Evil up gives me a black art. And range, how, how far is my range now? That's pretty good. Don't really care about the shot speed. Library. Interesting. This is gonna give me bookworm. So, the bookworm transformation, I have a chance to shoot two tiers at once. I'm going to re-roll in here. Um, I could potentially cycle through all of the books. There are a lot of books in the game now, so that's quite unlikely, but I could. And then that'll just give me two items. Nice if we can get some batteries to do that though. I'm just gonna keep taking so hard to get full health. Actually I've got more health than I thought I did. So those give you, this item I can't remember what it's called, but it gives you magnetic tears. Um, it tends to get me stuck more often than help. I'm not really a fan of it, so we're just going to walk away from it. And we probably won't be able to re-roll it either, because I am, like I said, going to concentrate on... on the library to try and get as many books done as I can. I was about to check the secret room over here because that would have been nice. Because again I would have been able to go into boss challenge room. But I 
Luckily, so now we know where it was. Oh, this way is to the boss. I wasn't expecting that. I was kind of actually expecting another lucky penny as well. I was expecting that to be the other side. I was kind of going on the placement of where the top secret room was. gap there okay I'm gonna break the rule what I said I was gonna do and I'm gonna potentially have a reroll for if I get an angel room because I'm not gonna be able to reroll through a lot dang it I'm not gonna be able to reroll through a lot of books Okay, well we didn't get an angel room, so that's fine. Um, got a Q mate, orbital that orbits around me, protects me from projectiles, and does contact damage to enemies that will hit into it. Probably as many books as we're going to be able to re-roll. Again, unless there's a battery potentially in the top secret room. on the floor. It's quite a few. I'll use this a little bit. Good money there. We'll pay you some of it. I guess I'm going to let you get me down to 20. Just so I've got enough for the next floor. I mean, if you want to keep on dropping hearts, I feel like I've invested too much money now. Sure. Right, mate, help up. Pretty good on red hearts now, so I don't really want to get too much more. I can't get the heart. Oh, I can get the heart. Didn't overspend too much. Well, I did. I said I wanted to stop at 20. But I should get enough for the shop again. What do we have in here? I'll probably come back for you. 
just because that'll be three charges of my on my D6. If I haven't got a room to re-roll in, I don't want to waste them. And a little bit of extra money. Flies. These are the worst flies. Okay, we're wasting charges now. So this is the exact opposite of what I wanted. I feel like I wasn't in the way of that laser. Bunkers hat, sure. So the Splunkers hat, when I'm standing next to or two rooms away from a secret room, so here, shows me where the secret room is, and also if there's special rooms, like an item room, shop, or anything two rooms away from me it will show me that direction or it will show me where it dates like the next room to where I am it's kind of nice so if I go through one of these when I get to a room it whoops oh that's my back card done so yeah, it shows me two rooms ahead. So if I go into the room on my right, there won't be anything there for me. Because here you can see that this room at the bottom. Well, let's make it bigger. I can see that there. I can see the shop there. So this room, I know there's nothing adjacent to me there. So it kind of is a slight map increase but only a couple of rooms in advance. But it's going to be useful. Not really anything I want. bomb it at that room as well. A little bit too slow. my angel room okay. that was a little terrifying we're going to take toothpicks tears and shot speed up a 
kind of want to use you once, but I'm going to do this first. So before I do the reroll, take use the prayer card once so I can get a an eternal heart, which will give me another red heart, which I said I was done with having them. But the fact I've already lost all my soul hearts, I need to get as many red hearts as I can. Plus, it's not a bad thing to get more of them. Because when I get to um, the dark room. Okay. When I get to the dark room, I will. I will need to give up health for the items in the chest at the start. Uh, we got the holy mantle from the angel room after the reroll, which is a shield on myself. And if I get hit, it's just free damage. And then it re uh, re recharged itself, kind of thing. I don't know what the word for that would be. Um, every room. So I get a free hit every room. So there I did take the one hit. And it's back with me in this room. Holy Mountain was very good. It could be the difference between me getting and losing a Angel Room as well. Could also use it to go into that Sacrifice Room as well, which I might do. Guess that's not a bad idea. So hot? No. Way too close. Let's do this room the easy way. Don't free him. a lot of health. I want those, but I don't want to get hit by that purple fire. Oh, this room is not good. I'm amazed I didn't get hit there. So you got Mucomosis. However you say that, that's a really good item. So I shoot these kind of... I guess they're fungus type tears. They stick to an enemy. And then they start growing. And then it poisons the, en um, the, the enemy. And then shoots off to other enemies from that. Uh, I like it. 
I think it's a really good item. Uh, we'll take you. And we'll take you as well. Sure. Uh, we also got the membership card, which gives us this extra shop where you get a lot more different variety of things. And the prices are a lot different as well. And we got sticks, which is a... Is it sticks or sty? This one's sty, yeah. I don't know what I'm saying sticks for. Um, which in one, every alternate shot is an increased damage and range. Sun. I'm going to take the sun. That's actually better than what I was carrying, which was the hermit. Yeah, I prefer I prefer this to the hermit. Oh, okay. I'll just get that red heart now. Actually, nothing I really want to re-roll, so all these extra batteries just going to go to waste, but dang it. Oh, the top secret room's here. This is not a good place. Wasn't worth it anyway. I don't really care about that money. It's in a very precarious place. I'd rather not. I'd rather not put myself at risk of losing any hearts. And we are in a mom fight. Wasn't sure if we were or not. You all just keep away. I hate those arms. I always get hit by them and I don't know how. Well, that's made me sad. 1% chance for an angel room. Very unlikely. Yeah. Uh, negative. It's negative, right? Yeah. That's the whole point of Isaac. This run. We've also had some really bad luck with angel rooms anyway this run. We've had the devil room and an angel room. That was only because it was a 100% chance for the, the angel room a second time. Mm, Reroll? That's good. Do I take it though? Yeah, we'll take it. So transcendence is just flight. I could have probably rerolled more, and I probably should have, but I don't think I picked up Transcendence before. It doesn't really give anything else, it's just Flight, but Flight's good. Unless we get this chest without having to take the damage for the chest in front of it. The Hangman, no, that's, that's Flight. I don't need that. I already have Flight, permanent Flight. This room is very crowded. I don't like it. Pill. Is this from the small? Yeah, that's right. No, it wasn't. It was from the other one. I don't want to be larger. I thought it was from the small enemy, so I could have been tiny. Whoops. Oh, no. I don't know why I got stuck then. 
so hard. I could have used you. It's okay though, I won't hold too much of a grudge. So it's unlikely that I'm going to get a angel room on this for 11% not great. So I've got to rely on the next four being my only other chance of getting one. Whoops. Again, expecting a bit more damage than I do have. Oh no, oh no. Shooting too many of them. Stop. Make it stop. Oh god. How did I not get hit then? Well, that was interesting. Oh, and we did get the engine room. Okay. These are two good items. I guess I want the wafer though. I'm going to take it now. So the wafer is damage resistance, like I said. So instead of on these floors, because on these floors you take full heart health, um, I'll only take half heart. So. I'm pretty happy with the, with the ones I've got so far. And we'll reroll on here. Another health up, sure. It's a little more health than I would like. But again, I've got to give up hearts in the dark room. If I like the items that I get. So I guess it's not a bad thing to have. Eight red hearts? Yeah, wow. I'm not going to go that way. I don't know if because that other route, the big room is a big room, if it's covering. Yeah. If it's just, if there are rooms adjacent to it. I think even if it's a big room, it should still show if there's rooms next to it. So I'm going to assume I don't have to go through it yet. So hot is worth it. Get the slight increase of an angel room, see if I can try and get one more.
Not taking pills this run. I was kind of hoping for the item for a reroll though. That's the only reason I did that room. I was about to say we've got to be close to an end of, a, of this for some, some way or another. My tears are so slow then. I'm not fast enough. Now we didn't get the angel room. Uh, yeah, down. Just making sure. Gotta make sure that I don't get this wrong. I haven't had a single speed up either, this run, which... I don't know if that's... that's not really ideal. Could you, could you please get hit? <laughs> I can't find the placement, I'm too big. We're not going to risk getting hit by that fire for one bomb. Oops. Two sons. I mean, I don't need to carry two of them. Yeah. 
don't like being on this side. I like being on the left. That's better. Stop. I'm too slow for this. Make it stop. I don't feel good about this. Wow, that shows a lot of the map. <laughs> this game. This game. Okay. Let's let's just let's do this. Go ahead. Useless. None of those are really that great. <laughs> I wasted so much health on this. Okay, um, we got the sun now. That's that's actually we know exactly where we're going now. Um, yeah, no, I I don't feel good about this run anymore at all. I'm so slow. I don't like it. Stop. No, you can't. You can't do this. No. I guess bloody lust isn't bad when I do take inevitably so much damage. Oh yeah, I've got a little brim. A little brim can do damage to me, even at the front. Bilbrim could be my saviour in all of this. Okay, that was a lot more damage than I really wanted to take. Heart. I'll take that. I didn't name say any of what the items I got do, just because of how disappointed I was with them all. Um, but uh, the first one I picked up was Goat's Head, which would normally just give me a um, would give me a hundred percent chance for the Devil or Range Room. I don't know if it does Range Room as well. But it would give me a 100% chance on that, so if I had that earlier on, I would have had Devil and or Angel Rooms in the run a lot more frequently. Which would have been nice. Um, I got Aphrem, is it called? I don't even know what it's called. But, oh, okay, an item. Okay, that was a bad item. Um, which, when I'm beating enemies, that's the thing that's giving a chance for a black void attack to spawn. Which, I quite like that. That does damage to enemies. It used to be, I think, when it was a charge item, or when I took damage, it used to, used to do that. So they've 
they've changed it and actually I think they've changed it for the better I think it's a lot better when an enemy um, when you beat an enemy they they does the effect then oh there's a heart there go back to that uh, and then we got bloody lust which when I take damage it increases my my attack or my damage so which is why I actually have some decent damage now and that stacks on the until the floor um, and then we got bomb friend which picks up money and drops items for you uh, the linger bean is it called which is why sometimes I'm dropping a fog which if that hits an enemy does damage to them um, anemic which if I take damage will cause a blood trail to follow behind me and does damage to enemies that hit into it and I've been did I go in here? No. Do I, not blow you up. Okay. Doesn't matter. And then I got Bozo, which is a point one damage up and has a chance for enemies to either be charmed or feared by me. And if I take damage it can drop a rainbow poop. It's not great. But it's okay. Not a biggest fan of it. But we should have enough health. Oh no. We'll have enough health for this. That shouldn't be a problem. Do a victory lap? No. And we're just going to leave. Take the victory. I'd say that was very well deserved. <laughs> and we've got the lost poster. Didn't know that I didn't unlock the lost poster yet. I've been trying to do some things to get with the lost poster. <laughs> I thought I'd already unlocked it. Huh. Interesting. Well, at least I've unlocked that now because that's something I've been looking for. I can't believe I didn't do that. Anyway, that is Isaac for now, until I can do a couple more things done. Um, so we'll probably have a bit of a break with Isaac again until we've done some certain unlocks and some certain things. But yeah, that was, that was an okay run. It was a well-deserved win. But that's going to do it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.